Hello, my friend. Don't let yourself be suppressed by other people. You have a right to be here and you need to associate yourself with enough people like yourself to be able to make space for yourself. So what it comes down to in the end, most importantly, is that you should not suppress yourself. If you don't find a way to create space for yourself, then yes, other people are going to push at you and they're going to dominate you and they're going to dictate to you and they're going to treat you poorly. But other people are not going to just automatically or spontaneously make room for you. That is something we only do for the people we love and care for. In order to establish a loving and caring relationship, you've got to first be able not to suppress yourself and to know how to take up the right kind of space. Not so much that you push into other people and not so little that other people can push into you. So for that to be possible, you've got to be stopping suppressing yourself and accommodating other people's space. This is not about becoming a space invader, but it is also not about allowing yourself to be pushed into the corner all the time. You've got to come out of that corner and you've got to start practicing how to do that and how to take up that space in the world. And that is something you won't get right the first time round. It takes a lot of time to ease yourself into the world and to discover what you can say, what you can't say, what you can do, what you can't do, how to be with this group of people, with that group of people. It's a skill you acquire. It's exactly the same as learning how to ride a bicycle or anything else. It is about practicing and it is about making it your own and becoming comfortable with it instead of telling yourself that you cannot do that you cannot be in the world and you cannot take up your own space of course you can you are in the world you have a body like everybody else and therefore you can learn to move about in the world and to be with others in a way that leads to you feeling comfortable and at ease and not overly objectable to other people, objectionable to other people and not overly pleasing other people either. It's about finding that right way forward and that right way you only discover by doing it and adjusting. And don't be afraid to make mistakes. It's fine. Other people will just get to learn to know you and they will change their minds as you get better at things. And they'll update their picture of you. And you, my friend, will update your picture of yourself and the feeling you have about yourself and the feeling you have about your rights and your abilities and your responsibilities that come with that. You will update that image as you learn. So start learning and stop telling yourself there's no space for you in this world because my friend there is, there's space for all of us and you have a perfect right to be here, to hold your own and to take your responsibility in contributing something of value for all of us. Looking forward to your contributions. Take care, my friend. Take good care of your space. It matters.